All right, hot chocolate, virtual 15K, third year in a row, which means I'm officially a legacy member. Very excited about the race. I'm running it with a friend of mine, Steve, who actually ran my first hot chocolate race with me. I did the 15K, he did the 5K, but especially excited because this will be his first ever 15K, um, his longest run to date. So looking forward uh, to a very fun race. I'm just taking it easy, still coming back from all this IT band nonsense, but looking forward to enjoying some miles with him. Cheers, y'all. How's it going? Just a quick introduction before we get into the actual race footage itself because I realized I did a pretty terrible job introing the race or giving any kind of context before we jumped into the actual running itself. So I thought I would just kind of go over some of the pre-race details. If you're not interested in that, feel free to skip ahead in the video, but just wanted to kind of give you some context, give a little intro before we get to the race itself. Obviously, as I've mentioned before, I am a huge fan of the Hot Chocolate Race Series. I love the series as a whole. Hot Chocolate Philadelphia happens to be the closest race to me, so that's the one that I've run the last three years. The last two years have been virtual, obviously, but I've said before in videos, I think Hot Chocolate, the Allstate Hot Chocolate series does an incredible job recreating as close to the in-person experience as they can in a virtual setting. And what I mean by that is, it's not just you register, you get the medal, you run the race, you register, there's a ton of communication before the race, you get all the incredible swag, you get the goodies to set up your aid station like we did, which you'll see in the race footage itself. Um, you get the hot chocolate, you just, they do a lot to try to recreate that community in a virtual setting, trying to do what they can to bring runners together in the virtual setting while we wait to hopefully resume in-person racing shortly. So was very excited for this run. I mentioned in the intro before the video that this was my buddy Steve's first ever 15K and his longest run to date. So was very, very excited to run the race with him. Obviously new territory for him. And then I was dealing with my IT band issue as well. So the plan was to just go out, not try to push the pace, not try to crush any kind of insane goal time, but just go out and enjoy the run. So my wife and I drove out and met Steve and his girlfriend Alyssa out at her house. He had planned the route ahead of time, about a 2.8 eight, three, a little under a three mile loop basically. So we figured we'd just do that loop three and then tack on a little bit extra at the end to uh, finish out the 15K. But that was nice because then we could have that aid station set up at the home base, which we would run by every uh, three-ish miles. Strategy for the race, like I said, was just to take it easy, not do anything crazy, not push ourselves too much. So both of us just kind of ran at a very controllable pace. I think we started the race at around like a 10, 20 mile and then slowly increased our speed from there. Nice conversational pace, just talked the whole time no music or anything, just really enjoyed getting out for a run, especially since it has been so long since I've been able to accrue any kind of significant mileage. This was great for me and I was very happy to say that I was running pain-free. I felt comfortable the whole time, in control the whole time, no pain, no issue at all. So really, really just enjoyed the race. And like I said, we were able to slowly pick up the speed as well, especially for the last like mile, mile and a half. We really kicked it into high gear. We actually tacked on some extra distance so that Steve could complete a 10 miler, first ever 10 miler. So we tacked on that extra distance and I think by the end, like right as we were coming up on 10 miles, we were at about an eight minute pace. So obviously picked up the pace significantly at the end. We were both feeling great. So just very excited for an incredible race, getting out, logging some miles with friends, which it has been so long since we've been able to do um, and being able to enjoy a virtual race with other runners. It was a lot of fun. Steve did great. Very excited to see what uh, is coming up for him and his running career in the future. Hopefully you can stay tuned for some of that in the future. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you don't already. I would say the only thing maybe he may have to work on is, is his water bottle tossing skills to the crew, which you'll get a glimpse of in the video. But yeah, great race, had a lot of fun, thanks to our incredible crew for supporting us. And without further ado, let's just jump into that race footage. Virtual Hot Chocolate 15K, very excited. Steve's first 15K. Going for a new PR. New PR, <laughs> automatic PR, always love it. Gonna be a good race. <laughs> Woo! Solid. I've set up this lovely station. Lauren and I will be staff members today. We got our goodies, our chocolate, our bars. Noon. Our yeah. Woo! Let's get it. Can't wait. Here we go.
forgot to hit record. Can you go back? I'm just kidding, I did. <laughs> you did it! Now presenting <laughs> the medal for the finisher! Let's go! Yes.